So some exciting news in the community this week is that our very own James, aka Lasers, broke the world record for Assassin's Creed 1, speedrunning it. The fastest playthrough of all time of this game. The game that, I mean, made his YouTube channel, one of his favorite games of all time. It's only fitting one of our own as the world record. Um, I just told Dave before we started recording about this, let's watch the end result here of um, James breaking the world record. It was his second attempt, but we'll get into that after. Let's just watch this. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. He looks so stressed. You know what I mean? Like, let's imagine... Go. The official time will be here in a second. As soon as the, the first line of the credits appear at the bottom, I hit the split and we're done. Game breaks. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. The first line of the credits, the first line of the credits. There it is, we did it! Four hours... 24 minutes, 3 seconds. We fucking did it. That's it. That's the new fucking console world record for Assassin's Creed 1, boys. We fucking did it. Oh my god, man. Oh, oh I can relax. Oh my <laughs> god. Fuck me. Dude, imagine that. Oh my god. I wasn't... He was streaming, like, Shit, middle man. of the night Why? for us. Wow. Drop pause that there. Oh, he was streaming in the um, middle of the night for us, so... Couldn't watch it, but watching that a lot of that, I watched quite a bit of it back. And it's just so tense, man. Like, and I'm just sitting there like, even though I know he did it by the time I was watching it, I was like, holy shit. Like, that's, I was like stressing. I was like, oh my God, I could feel how tense he felt. Especially the closer you get, because that was his second attempt at the full run. Like, obviously he's done months of training and practicing segment 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 and mastering it which has been like incredible the way like i'll, I'll be doing podcasts with him and i can hear him doing the controls He's like i'm just practicing speed run roots and stuff just roots over and over and over and over and over again like it's a lot of like surely you would hate this game after this True. like you know surely you would just and that's why i don't do it you were asking me about speed running and like should i do would i do something mm. like would i attempt which did you say what no, or did he did, did he say why he chose ac1 um, I think it's because it's the, uh, I think it was the only one that really had a bit of a speed running community community. Interesting. It's also the original game. And I think, you know, in a lot of ways it's his favorite, you know, it's what brought him into the franchise. I think it made the most sense. And it's the shortest one, I believe as well to speed run. Interesting. I think the world record for AC2 was like, and brother like a bit more than that, like five at, in the five hour range. Hmm. So I think it was a bit more doable for James in the sense of one, it's quicker, but also I think he, he's, it's the one he, he would maybe say that he's best at, mm. that he's best at, which is cool. Oh, it's amazing. It's so amazing that someone in our community, but not just anyone like James of all people, he's the number one. I mean, in the sense of if you call being good at a game, like how fast you can get through it and complete it. He's the best in the world at Assassin's Creed 1. Like, that's... Uh, he has a world record. That's pretty incredible. True. He said console, Xbox. Is there a... Is there a um, uh, I don't... Game? I think there must be different ratings. I, you, can, you can play AC1 on, on PC? Yeah, you can. Yeah. Yeah. I wonder it, what, the, what the PC record is and how it's different. Whether well, I think it just... cuts load times out. Yeah. You know what I mean? I think like, there's a way you could probably glitch by exiting the game. Yeah. I mean, don't get me wrong. Like, he, I've, he was definitely had to use glitches you know what i mean yeah. like at certain points to like break not break the game but like trick the game cheat yeah. it um that he used throughout but like that was the second attempt he did it the other day on friday i think was his first attempt and maybe thursday and one of the glitches didn't work properly yeah and totally fucked up his run like just totally fucked up his run i think there's a few things that went wrong and i hear a few things went wrong in this run but he still managed to do it man like, it's, it's something I never thought about. And you were uh, asking me before the show when I was talking to you about it. Um, would I do one? Like, would I do AC2? Yeah. It's like, dude, fuck that. Like, I love these games. I love replaying the Ezio trilogy. I'm streaming it at the moment. Like, I love that. I don't want to ruin the games for myself. And I feel like 
obsessing over AC2 and just playing the same shit over and over and over again. Oh, it, would just, it wouldn't ruin it because they're great games. It would change the way you view the game, though. Mm. You'd never be able to play it. James is never going to be able to play AC1 without remembering the quickest routes and feeling like that's how he has to play it. With speed, he can't just play it. Yeah, true. And have a bit of fun with it. He like literally will be like, this is the fast route. This is how you do it. This is how you play. This is how you play the game. Like it's supposed to be played this way. Um, and I'll be interested to see if he attempts to break his own record down the line or someone else attempts to break the record because it's not just anyone that's got the record. It's someone with a massive following um, and specifically for that franchise. So that's You will often deal. find that like once... Dude, I was watching these speedrunning videos. There's these amazing... There's, a, there's an amazing community of speedrunners out there. I don't speedrun games, but I love... My well, honestly, it's what, I, I've been, you know, what I've been watching um, in my spare time, like before I go to bed or whatever. Um, there's huge, huge speedrunning community and it's... Um, not even just specific games, but if, if someone speed runs a game that's never been speed run before, you'll find all of these people come out of the woodwork and just go, all right, let's fucking do it. Like, um, fucking, um, we golf, like people, like some guy just like got all the holes, like got, did all the holes or something in like 13 minutes. I, that's like a random number, but did it in a certain time. And then all these random speedrunners just came out like, all right, cunt, like, let's fucking Oh, do it. yeah, right. And then they just, they got like, there was like all of these people and that they, they like got it down just, just for fun. Like, that's what these but guys I, but do. But I think James is hoping for that as well. Yeah, it'd be good for the AC community because it's pretty dead, you know, in terms of like... <laughs> True. You know, like, OG. Like, what, like, what's the, you know, what's, there's not much appeal, you know. Well, anymore. that's, that's the thing, like, you asked me, like, what would I do? And I, the other thing I, like, when I was competitive at it was Assassin's Creed multiplayer, like... I've been ranked like in the top hundred in the world during different periods of time over the course of I. I wasn't big in the Brotherhood days. Revelations was the one I played the most. AC three a lot, and same with and Black Flag a little less, but I think Black Flag is one I've probably been ranked the most time in. Like I think I got like in the top fifty in the world mm. um, for console. Yeah, but um, that's because there's fifty three players. There's there, there are like. it's true there are fifty three players. That's true. That's accurate. Um, but but honestly, man, like I was very competitive at that. Yeah, true. I I was obsessed with that during the like I would what I would watch online would be like multiplayer videos on YouTube, yeah. and I just like, obsessed over it and loved to play, and I just loved being good. I was never a big I've never been a big person into multiplayer or any kids think competitive in games. I just you know, like to chill out. But Assassin's Creed, I was so like wanted to be the best, and I've never had that before. Um, and, you know, I've made the Tynamite character off that doing the multiplayer battles with a few of the guys over the years, especially the one James and I did in 2017, which is a lot of fun. But what who, everyone who finds is... Win, who, would, who do you think would win in, like, a 1v1, like, stalk-off, like you or James? Oh, I've, we've already done that. Oh, true. I've, oh, dude, I destroyed him. True. Like, just absolutely obliterated him. It wasn't even close. And he's very good at it, too. Because we've gone and played group multiplayer. And he's always, like, second best by far. By yeah. far. And yeah, yeah, I just, I dude, I'd whoop I, all of the other YouTube boys. They, they all know yeah. uh, how much I'd whoop them because they've played against me. True. Yeah, yeah, a hundred percent. And they played against James, and they're like, "Oh, you, you got flogged by Tyler, and you're beating my ass." Yeah, it's because James is good. I'm just one of the best players, you know, that that played the game. Yeah. You know, none of those guys did. I was that was just uh, for whatever reason that was my thing. That was one of my things. I, and I loved it during the time. But I, I'd love to bring it back, have some sort of tournament community going and like revive that here or there. Maybe the Black Flag multiplayer would be fun. Because I've got a platinum. When I stream Black Flag after the Ezio trilogy, I've got a platinum that on the PS5 and there's multiplayer on it. And there's multiplayer trophy, so I've got to get it. Get the trophies. How long did it take you to get high, high ranked in AC multiplayer? Oh, hundreds of hours. Yeah. Yeah. Well, at least a hundred hours. Because you, you'd be a pre, you you know you you sort of start off your low level you max level out you get a prestige and you you know you work on your classes and then once you're in your prestiges that's when you're really just doing work you're in the zone you've got all your abilities you've mastered the maps and you're just bang 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 with the game modes mm. um, so that's you know and once you're there you're there um, for quite a while so. It's um and then you only match with those sorts of people, but it was just it's just it's just, it was just a fun environment. I always loved it, and I'd love to be a part of that again. The multiplayer is fun, but yeah, it's just cool. It's I just wanted to talk on the show about you know congratulate James because it's a huge achievement um, to do that. And I know how I know how hard he's worked and how many hours he's put into this, and to have a goal like that, a little project like that, and to do it second attempt and have he had the creator of Assassin's Creed congratulate him and not and as, as in Patrice who got fired from Ubisoft 
because he wanted like creative control and he was the he made AC one, two and Brotherhood and they fired him at the after Brotherhood. He's like the one who created the franchise. Why'd they fire him? Um, creative differences. Like I think he was like Assassin's Creed's mine. And I wanted is... AC to be good and Ubisoft like no we want yeah, to be yeah. fucking it's li- shit. It's almost literally that. Yeah. Like Patrice is amazing. Like he's he, he is the father of Assassin's Creed. Of like true real Assassin's Creed. Not not the shit that we ended up getting. So to have him, like Patrice come out, who created the concept for AC1 and go, dude, congratulations, that's awesome. That's cool to see. So James, congratulations. Proud of you. Um, and I look forward to seeing if anyone else attempts the, the speed run um, to beat James. And then this continues to be a thing throughout 2021. That's cool. 